Hi, it's Josh from Apt at CES 2016, partnering with WGN Chicago. We've got Rob here from Stampede, a distribution company that not just has the coolest brands of all these drones, but all sorts of great services. Now, Xfold. Now, when I look at these drones, this is a way out of my comprehension as to what I'm looking at here. This looks like we're taking it up a notch. What do we? What's what? What is Xfold giving us? Xfold takes it out of the consumer realm and bring starts getting you into the prosumer and then commercial realm. Uh, so their first drone here is the X, uh, the Xfold Spy. The Spy is going to be your GoPro, your action camera drone. So it'll 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 carry your your GoPro, your live action camera, and do something very similar to your consumer base. So your consumer drones. However, this is going to deal with wind a lot better because it is an X8. Uh, so w when I reference X8, eight propellers on the drone instead of just four, or instead of six, depending on uh, which okay. drone you're comparing Got it, it to. Uh, and give you a little bit longer of flight time when, uh, on these, when we're talking to about 25 minutes of flight time, okay. uh, instead of that 18 to 20 on some of the consumer side. Awesome. Uh, some of it push it into the, the, the 20 to 25, but this will give you a little bit longer. Very cool. So out of the consumer side, let's get into the commercial side, let's, or high-end prosumer, next with the 3D mapper, uh, okay. the one we, we offer here. So anybody that wants to get into 3D mapping, Xfold has a complete solution that they offer the drone that'll uh, handle the heavy wind, has the proper gimbal on it, but also that 3D mapping software that's ever so important because you need software to be able to analyze the data and do all that. Uh, built off this same platform, the same size platform, uh, Xfold also offers the, a drone called the Travel. The Travel takes this off this uh, option and allows you to put a DSLR camera on that. And that's this guy hanging up there. Yep. So this is the, this guy hanging right up top uh, uh, that allows you, and with one gimbal, to really use a couple different DSLRs or a couple different camera options. Some of its competitors right now require you to have the different gimbals for different cameras. This one gives you one gimbal couple different camera options. So there are specific camera models though that would be compatible with that gimbal? Yes, there's uh, very sp uh, there is specific camera models, okay. but what they do with that gimbal is they open it up so you can have three or four cameras per gimbal instead of just one and one. Oh. <laughs> yeah, so some of its okay. competitors, if you're flying a Panasonic camera, you need that specific gimbal. Right. You can't differ from that at all. Awesome. So when you move from this guy, is there a a next step up then? Of, of course there's a next step up, there's, there has to be. And this is when you get into the large drones. Uh, the, the one we're looking at here is the uh, Xfold Cinema. This is an X8 that we have represented here at CES, but they also offer the X12. Okay. Very cool options. So the, the X8 we're looking at, Red Epic cameras. You're, when we're talking movie making, when you're, you're talking about Game of Thrones, Expendables. All right, this, so this is the this real deal here. here. <laughs> this is the real, the real deal. So in, in the X8 format, you, you have a payload capacity of about 85 pounds, wow. Rel relatively well. <laughs> but at the same time, those Red Epic cameras don't weigh that much, so we're increase, increasing flight time. Th this is why this uh, succeeds uh, so well in Hollywood, in, the, in these Hollywood movies, in these big time movies, is because it has uh, long lasting, reliable flight and can carry any, relatively any camera that you need. Once you get into the X12 version of this is when you're talking heavy winds. Obviously, Mother Nature doesn't yeah. work with us all the time, so if you've got to deal right. with wind, th this drone also gives you that option. They go beyond this as well into the, uh, the X-Fold Dragon. The, the Dragon comes in the X8 and X12 configuration, uh, and that's when you're talking about dual red epics. So this, the cinema will carry one. If you want to now make 3D movie, you're talking about two red epics. It'll oh, carry man. it. <laughs> <laughs> so like if, uh, if, if a big cinematic production is utilizing this really cool drone, yes. I mean, are they, do they just have one on the set? Are there like five on the set? How it, does that work out? Have you ever had a customer that's buying multiple for their production? Yes, yeah, we, we do have customers <laughs> out there that are buying multiple or at the si same time hiring multiple pilots. Uh, so what, one of the uh, markets in this industry is actually becoming a drone pilot, learning how to fly them. Right. And at the same time, then you're getting hired by yeah. Warner Brothers to fly in their movies. Wow. <laughs> and we do have uh, so in some of our services, yeah. uh, we have uh, some education. And right. the, the actually the manufacturer of these this actual drone, right. it, it has a production background. So they actually flew in these movies with their drones. Very cool. Thanks a lot for the update. Thank you. A lot more to come at CES 2016 drones. Really big in the commercial industry, very cool from Xvolt. Thank you, Stampede, and check out app.com for more information.